Welcome back to the awesome Look, I, I didn't do a whole bunch of jumping because I'm not stepped too hard. I don't want to fall and break my head. So, today is Vlogtober mm. day. One? Four? I think four. it's gonna be day four. Vlogtober day four. And if you can see in the corner right behind Whitney, it's a small pumpkin. So, being in the festive November, fall. It's October, not November. Oh, Lord Jesus. <laughs> being in the October, fall vibe. We got to make a pumpkin pie from scratch, y'all. Oh, so, yeah, from scratch. For those of y'all who might be finding us for the first time, it's Vlog Tober. We are the Andersons. This is the Anderson this is family baby. vlog. And Mom had a baby three months ago. If you're not already a subscriber, make sure you hit that subscription right there at the bottom of the corner. And while you're down there, go ahead and hit the notification bell because we're going to be doing Vlogtober. That means a video every day in October. All right, we're back. All right, so we are going to get started. And the first thing we're going to do is make the crust of the pie. So we have about five ingredients that we need for the crust. Um, sugar butter, salt, flour, and shortening. We're going to mix that together until it's nice and blended. So now we are going to sit our crust in the refrigerator. You want to sit it in the coldest part of your refrigerator, which is usually in the back corner of the refrigerator. Okay, so now for the pie part. So of course for pumpkin pie, the main ingredient is pumpkin. So for that, we have to make pumpkin puree. So you need to get a small pumpkin from your grocery store. Usually it'll have... Um, cooking pumpkin on it, right? No, yeah, pie pumpkin. Oh, pie pumpkin on it, sorry. <laughs> he bought the pumpkin. So, <laughs> usually it'll have pie pumpkin on it. It's just a little small pumpkin. Hey. And one of these will actually give you enough puree to make two pies. So, um, plenty of puree. First thing you want to do is set your oven to 425 degrees and let it preheat. So, what we need to do is we are going to cut the pumpkin in half. Um, and then bake it um, for about 40 to 50 minutes so we can get a nice puree out of it. So let's get started with that. You're gonna bake it on a cookie sheet and we put a aluminum foil down just so we don't mess up the cookie sheet. Now our pumpkin is nice and gutted, so we are just gonna put them on a cookie pan and throw them in the oven. Remember your oven should be on 425 degrees and we're gonna cook them for about 40 to 50 minutes and we'll keep a check on them. All 
All right, so yes, we switched spots. I am in the kitchen and I am about to roll the door out. So Whitney wanted me to do it, so if, if it messed up, she could blame me. But you know what, I ain't gonna mess it up. I'm gonna roll this dough out like a pro out. You to make, you want me to do if you're not in this kitchen, you can't talk to the camera right now. So, <laughs> so let's roll this dough out, y'all. So I got the door rolled out and now I'm just gonna tuck the edges in and kind of like decorate the around the, y'all know how they do the, the door. Okay, so it has been 40 minutes. We are gonna check on the pumpkins. Um, and what we're gonna do is something called the fork test. So you take a fork, if it goes all the way through, um, then it's done. Got the pumpkins out of the oven we'll let them cool off before we scoop out the inside to corral and i will get the rest of the ingredients together and measure everything out but bye Mix the sugar with the spices. What sugar? Huh? Mm -hmm. Now we're gonna sit this to the side and we are gonna slightly beat the egg. So going back to the puree mix, we're gonna add um, maple syrup and vanilla abstract, which is mixed right here, and the heavy cream into the puree. Alright, so now we just gonna pour the pumpkin mixture into the pie crust and put it in the oven for 40 to 50 minutes or I think they said 40 to 50 minutes then turn the oven down and no. 15 minutes, turn it down 350 Okay, so she said put it in there for 15 minutes at 425 then, then turn it down to 350 
then bake it for 90 minutes. So, Dad, how long is it? <laughs> So that's it, the pie has cooled, we finished making it, and uh, I think it's a success. Now, I didn't want to tell y'all this, <laughs> my sister from How the Camera Shake her head no. I didn't want to tell y'all this until we finished, but this was our first time making a pumpkin pie. So, you know, <laughs> don't, don't, judge don't, don't judge us, don't judge us. <laughs> So, if you want to see the pumpkin pie, go ahead and like the video before you see the pumpkin pie right now. Go ahead, we'll wait. Alright, so let's take a look at this pie. So, thanks for watching. Uh, make sure you hit the notification bell. And if you want a uh, post notification shout out, just hit the notif- well, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and type Hashtag notification squad in the comments. <laughs> All right, and this is out. No recording. That was the NKD record. Don't put me on this video. How is it? It's good. Don't put me on this. Video. Oh, it's good. Don't put me on this dang on video. Good. You better turn it towards it that way and look. But I it's good. Is it good or not? I just told you what it was. Don't so put me on this video. Okay, Quaisha. I did not authorize the consent of you putting me on this video. I did not consent. I will not put this on. The... Nothing. Not YouTube, not Facebook, not Twitter, not nothing. Not oh. Instagram, not nothing. Okay, I won't put your, uh, your no face. No kind of social media. I won't put your face on YouTube. Now you think I'm okay. Yeah, I'm good. Do that. Is it good?